Average women have the equivalent sexual pull as a male celebrity. Why is this on my feed? My algorithm is busted. So an average woman, if she was so inclined, could sleep with a new guy every single night of the week. She could probably sleep with two, three guys a day. Easily. I don't know if he realizes it, but all he's saying is that it's really easy to get men. Like, he's saying men are hoes, and it's not hard to get a man to give it up. In order for a guy to be able to do that, you, you are less than the top 1% of men. Like, women are very particular with who they choose to sleep with. You have to meet their standard of person before they'll sleep with you and men don't have that that's that's what he's saying why do guys complain about this so much it is men's fault that men are so easy it is men's fault that men are so thirsty if all she has to do is exist and men are going to be thirsting for her that is their fault she has no control over that that is their fault for being thirsty. Here are the two biggest issues I have with this complaint in particular. The first is that women don't do that. Why does it bother men that a woman could sleep with two or three dudes a day? They're not doing that. Nobody on that panel is sleeping with two or three dudes a day. So what difference does it make? That's not a real thing that's happening. Y'all getting pressed over a hypothetical. Do you know why men get upset that women can do that? It's because if men could sleep with two or three women a day, they 100% would. It's just jealousy. They're just mad because they can't do it. Then they got the nerve to call women who have actual self-control hoes. They slut shaming the people who actually say no. How does that make any sense? And the second problem that I have with this line of thought is that these men want women to sleep with as few men as possible. Have as low of a body count as possible. Body counts are too high. Women need to sleep with way fewer men, which means however much women are rejecting men now, that is not enough. Women should be rejecting way more men. Men are not facing nearly enough rejection. Because if they were, these body counts would be way lower. That's the world these podcasters are trying to create. You can't complain about the rise in lonely single men anymore. Because apparently it's not rising fast enough. This is a stupid ass complaint from men who are jealous that they can't sleep with every woman that crosses their path.